hearts, love, and a lot of red as we approach the day of love. Some seniors are actually celebrating a bit early. Reporter Marker Cavanaugh brings you to a sweetheart ball in Suffolk. Love is in the air for almost 200 seniors. I love it, just like I love Christmas. Every day can be Valentine, every day can be Christmas for me. It's a popular event, the Active Adult Sweetheart Ball, run by the Suffolk Parks and Recreation Department. Organizers say it sold out two weeks ago. We enjoy the festivities that they give for the seniors. They love getting dressed up and the dancing. This is what many of the people here tell me is their favorite part about the event. Just because they're seniors don't mean they can't still move and get down, honey, because they can. Still strutting their stuff. I'm a chocolate freak. I love chocolate. And keeping a sense of humor. I go out and buy my own self a box of candy and make myself satisfied. And remembering age is just a number. Case in point, these sisters, 98 and 101 today. She's unreal. She has 20-20 vision, and so she reads everything there is to read. And some of these couples know how to keep the spark alive. Never going to bed angry. Never. Never. That's hard one. It sure <laughs> is. 48 years of marriage is very romantic. It can be, yes. Offering some words of wisdom. Nobody's perfect, and it's 100-100, not 50-50. Once high school sweethearts. I was minding my business. <laughs> I didn't know her, and she grabbed me, <laughs> and here we are. 50 years later. Celebrating love and longevity. It's a lovely day because it's a love day, and I always enjoy. Come on, y'all. Here's to a happy Valentine's Day. Turn it up. I'm Marker Cavanaugh for News 3. Well, News 3 is tracking 2020 and the race.